If you wish to get more out of the Elemental Free version but don't know how to go about that, put your mind at ease because in this video I'm going to show you three free plugins that you can use to supercharge your Elemental Free version plugin. Bear in mind that each of these free plugins that I'm going to list out has some unique features that will make you want to combine all three of them or use two out of them or better still just one. In whichever case, your Elemental Free version will be supercharged for free. So let's get started with the Elemental add-on element. This is a very wonderful plugin. I mean, this is a complete powerhouse for all your web design needs. With this plugin, you can supercharge your Elemental free version experience by using their free widget. Guess what? This add-on comes with about 25 widgets and extension for you to use totally for free. So you can easily get this plugin either by clicking on this download button from their website, which takes you to a WordPress official website where you can download it or from your dashboard you can just search on it search for it here and then you get it easily yep and then this is it and you can just install and activate it i've already installed and activated it and so once you're done installing and activated and, and activating it you're going to see an option right below here tied to the elemental add on element no now you, you click on this option you can see from the list of various widget that comes with this particular plugin you can see it all here and what you can do is you can just select any of the widgets you do not want and then you deactivate them or you can perform a bulk action by deactivating that particular widget so once you've done with that you now go to your elemental dashboard so for that let's create a new page let's let's add a new page and let's um, make use of this widget let's call it uh page one or let's say plugin one plugin one and then let's just publish this okay now let's edit with elementor and this loads up for you okay so now once you, this is completely loaded up you can come down here just you can see this is a free elemental version and you can see all the pro features are locked you cannot use them so you just scroll down here and you see the option here called the elemental add-on element. So these are the various uh, widgets that comes with this plugin, all totally for free. Now, some of the elements that comes with this particular um, plugin are the timeline L widget. You can see when you drag the timeline widget, this is what you get. They have a couple of skins for you to make use of. You have the screen one, the screen two, and get this. You can also use some source custom source or source like uh, from post as well which is wonderful you can use the query and then you can even style it it's option for you to style this particular widget as well you can also go back here there are other widgets options that you can make use of or you can even drag and drop the animated text you can see this text is this is wonderful widget that allows you to use your animated text here are the text that gets animated yeah, these are the list of animated text you can add and edit you can remove them you can even style it as well there are some other notable features that you can use some other wonderful widgets that you can use take for instance the, the content switcher this is a wonderful widget and this is available on the elemental pro as as the tab widget now on this particular one you can edit it and set your skin different kinds of skin you can see this one is like the toggle and then you can also edit it and use something like this like this screen or you can just head back to screen one and then you come down and then you can add multiple lists to your uh to your items and get this now once you've done that now take for instance you want to edit the primary content now you can either use this normal text editor or you can come here and select from saved section saved page and you can just add it to this particular place for free this is a wonderful plugin and i think you might want to consider adding this to your list of plugins to use to boost up your elemental free version all right so the next on our list is the royal elemental add-on and template this is another wonderful add-on plugin for elemental page builder and get this the developers of this plugin are quite confident about their product to the extent that it is written on their website that this is the only elemental add-on you will ever need to build a website from zero to hero and trust me they might be right because this plugin comes with a full power pack for your elemental free version and you can even use it alongside the elemental pro version but that is up to you but with the free version and this plugin you can come up with a wonderful 
design and the plugin has over 80 elements over 80 elemental widgets that you can use some of which are the post grid slider carousel even for the wool slider carousel as well an image slider carousel magazine slider grid and slider and, and a whole bunch of other wonderful widgets and get get this these widgets are all available for free although with some level of restrictions that are available for the pro version but trust me with a free version you can still come up with a wonderful and professional website design and also the plugin also comes with um, some uh, a template library with over 50 plus templates that you can use and some of these templates are free and you might you won't believe it but the free version of these templates are very beautiful and something that you can use to start up your, your work as well so to get this plugin started you can head on to on the website right below here you can just click on the download button and it takes you to the uh, wordpress uh, website where you can download it here or right on your dashboard you can just come over here to the add new plugins and on the search plugins section you just search for royal elemental add-on and you, you get the plugin this is the plugin here so you just install and activate the plugin and once you've done that you can see that the plugin gives you a, a button right here where you can set things up for yourself. So once you click on the first link here, that's the Ruya add-on. You can see the list of add-on that are available, list of widgets that are available, and just a long list of wonderful widgets and features that are available. Even for the Team Builder widgets, you can see the available widgets for the Team Builder widgets. You can see that, uh, that the ones that are available for the WooCommerce. So we'll be using the WooCommerce. Be uh, widget builder because we, we do not have WooCommerce installed on this particular website but you can see there are just four four pro uh, widgets that that you can see all the rest widgets are available but do with some minor level of restrictions so now to get started let's test this and see what we got here so we just add a new page let's create a new page let's call this uh, plugin 2 let's call the page plugin 2 and let's publish it and uh, let's click on edit with elementor all right so when you toggle this off and you come down this right here is the royal add-on these are the various add-ons that come with this plugin and you can just use from either of them and make use of and do whatever you want to do from the list of wonderful wonderful features that you can use now take for instance you want to make use of the uh, promo box all you just need to do is drag it and then you drop it here okay now this is what we have here this is wonderful now uh, another feature that this widget comes with that is mind-blowing is this predefined style for each widget as in about 90% of the widgets that are here all have a predefined style that you can use so this predefined style you just need to click on it and it loads up a block containing free and premium uh, uh, designs for that particular widget as you can see so from this we can select to use any of this to make our um, edit so you and then but you just click on insert and easily it gives you a, a, a place a base to start your design from rather than going from scratch to do it so you can see this is what we have here you can now easily edit this and uh, change the image do whatever you want to do and that is just pretty much it with this um, promo box so when you go back to the the royal uh when you go back to the widget area you can see from the list of other widgets that we can use we can even come down here there is the form the hotspot widget most of these features are only available on the elemental pro whereas some are not even available on the elemental pro yet such as this particular one that i just made use of uh, so another, there's another feature that is uh, that this plugin also comes with that is very very wonderful. Take for instance, let's say we edit this particular uh, widget and we'll come down to the advanced settings. Now when you scroll down, you can see that there is a custom CSS here. This is only available on the Elementor Pro. However, this plugin also gives you the ability to add custom CSS for free. Now you can see just like the what you have in the Elementor Pro, this plugin has already give you the access to add custom CSS totally for free. And guess what? It doesn't just work on the element that comes with this plugin. It also works with Elementor Basic Element. Take for instance, you drag. Let's say we drag this heading widget and we drop it here. Now, if you should click on Edit and you go to the advanced settings of this widget, you come down. You can still see the CSS 
uh, the custom CSS option as well. So this plugin is a very wonderful addition to your list of plugins to supercharge your Elementor free version. So the last on our list is the Elementor header and footer builder. This plugin is a wonderful plugin and it's totally for free. With this plugin, you can build your custom Elementor header and footer and block anywhere on your website. So to get this plugin, you can either come get it from the wordpress.org official website. You can just download it here and install it on your website or you can go to your plugin section and then you just search for uh, Elementor header and footer builder and this loads up and you can see this is the plugin here i have already installed and activated the plugin so to access the plugin you just come down to your appearance and you scroll down you see the elemental header and filter builder so you click on it this is what you get now here you can click on this to add new header or filter depending on what you want so we're just going to add that and let's title this uh header and then let's come down to template option now you select which kind of template you want to build is it for header before footer footer or custom block so we're going to select the header and then we'll come to the display option now for the, on the display option you select where you want your header to display on this is amazing so now <clears throat> We're just going to select the basic, which is the entire website, and then you come down here to select the user role as well, which user this header will be visible for or will be visible to. You can select for all user, logged in user, logged out user, administrator, editor, and so on. Just select whatever you want. We're just going to select uh, all. So right below this, you can see you can enable the layout for Elemental Canvas template. What this does is that, you know, Elemental Canvas template comes with uh, no header, no footer. Um, um, page that is a totally blank page for you to use to design but with this once this is checked that um, elemental canvas canvas now comes with whatever header or footer you've built with this plugin it now shows on your elemental canvas so now that we've done that we're just going to click on publish all right the next thing we're going to do is we're just going to click on edit with elemental and this loads up our elemental page builder Now this is the screen we've gotten. So when you toggle this down, toggle this, toggle this as well, you now see right here, this plugin also comes with its own widgets that you can use to build your header and your footer easily. So let's, we're just gonna drag, um, let's add a structure, let's select the structure and let's build a quick header to test run this plugin. So once we've done that, we'll just click on this plus icon here and we'll come down to this, uh, elemental header and footer section and let's just drag the site logo let's drop it here and it pulls our site logo if we've set one if we've not set one we can easily set one so the next we're going to do let's add a menu here we'll come down here and you can see this it came it came with this own navigation menu you can drag and drop this navigation menu here or you can use navigation menu that is available on the listing on any other navigation menu that is available here you can use it to build this so once you've done that you just click this and then we will select uh to the end and then let's edit the the container the parent container and let's add some color to the background so that um, let's add some back color to the background let's see we'll give it uh what color let's give it this green <clears throat> Okay, let's give it this green. And then let's just edit this. Uh, let's change the text color. Let's change it to white. And the hover, let's change the hover to black. All right, this looks good. So we're just gonna update this. So now, when you go back to your website, let's say we'll go back to our website and if we should go back to our website now, you will see down that this particular header we built is active on the website so you can see this is it this is it's, it's an easy way for you to add this feature with your elemental free version that is not available however this uh, header and footer feature is already available on the elemental pro so for those that cannot for some reason or the other use the elemental pro you can use this to add the header and footer feature to your website easily
And so we've come to the end of this tutorial. I hope this was helpful to you. Please remember to give this video a thumbs up and drop your comments if you have other suggestions as to how you can supercharge your Elementor free version plugin. You can drop that on the comment section. If you're new to the channel, please remember to subscribe and hit the bell icon so you get notified first when next I drop a new video. Until then, see you. Bye bye.